straight to the point, unlike email, unlike uh, phone, there's no small talk with texting. Although it's just the same conversation we're having with the same people, it's just a different form. And the beauty about texting is you pick up right where you left off. Right, if we had a texting conversation when I met you four months ago, and hey Scott, are you gonna be at, uh, at Jim, Dibler, Jim Ziegler's deal? I would, we would have picked up right where we left off three months ago and you'd ask me a question after we left. You don't have that with chat, you rarely have that with email, you definitely don't have that with the phone. Now, Rhonda talked about this, it's called showrooming. When somebody's basically on your lot or a competitor's lot and they're basically going to your website, it's called showrooming. It's no different than what we do at Costco and we see that 20, 20 70 inch television that we want. Uh, the very first thing, if you guys got to know me a little bit, I'm cheap, I'm frugal. If I'm gonna buy a $1,500 TV, I'm gonna see if I can save a thousand or a hundred bucks. If I'm gonna spend 35, 40,000 dollars on a car, I'm gonna see if I can save a thousand dollars. This is happening, we're gonna get into these stats here in a second. And 49% of the consumers that use the smartphone ultimately made a purchase related to that experience. So I think we'd all agree that these folks are lower funnel. By the time they go on your mobile website, they're low funnel consumers. So where I'm getting with all this, ladies and gentlemen, there is a way to capture these consumers. We're gonna get into that in about two minutes. More stats to help paint the picture of what we're talking about. Let's agree that anything over 50% is the majority. 59% of the consumers research your dealerships, they go to your mobile site. You know, Christian had spoken about desktop sites and, and mobile sites and used some statistics. My, you know, the funny thing about statistics, you've never seen the same statistics. There was actually a stat that came out this morning, 92.5% uh, of all statistics are made up on the spot. It's a joke, I'll give you guys a couple seconds. Uh, but the nice thing is Christian's statistics, my statistics, uh, Rhonda's statistics are all very, very close. 25%, uh, one in four consumers will never even touch your desktop site, ladies and gentlemen. They're on your mobile site. So think about all, over all these years, the configurators, the, uh, Ron was dogging a little bit, but let's face it, the, the, the used car configurator, the trading configurator, the, 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 the payment configurator we were talking about earlier, Evergreen's very, very successful uh, a payment configurator that they have. A lot of them work. A lot of them will look a little bit tacky, a lot of them work, but what, what those are, they're mouse traps, right? It, it, it gets these consumers, Christian will tell you that probably 97, 98% of the consumers that come to your website leave quietly without leaving a footprint. And these configurators on your desktop site help capture the consumer. I've got to challenge everybody in the room. What configurators do you have on, on your mobile sites? Usually there's, there's, zero, there's zero, maybe one. 63% of the uh, use, use their mobile device while researching at the dealership. Ladies and gentlemen, when somebody is on a mobile phone outside your FNI office, outside your showroom, they're not talking to their wives. They're not calling their husbands. They're showrooming. What's a way to hook these consumers? And uh, again, anything over 50%, let's call the majority, the majority of the consumers that will show them at your dealership will ultimately leave the dealership based on that experience. Now the good news is when they're at your competitor's dealerships, right, when they're at your competition, if we can hook them, they're coming to you. And that's what the whole presentation is about. Why are they doing it? This is gonna be a quick slide. Price and availability. For the same reason the consumer would uh, call you, for the same reason the consumer would email you, for the same reason consumer would chat on your website. They are going to your website whether they're while they're showrooming, whether they're home for price and availability. So here's the mousetrap. It's very, very simple. Again, we've got all these mousetraps on our desktop sites. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm gonna introduce just a very simple